The digestive system is a complex system and when running correctly, it's very effective in processing food to feed the body and get rid of waste out of the body. Digestion is defined as the process where food is broken down ready to be absorbed into the bloodstream and distributed around the body. Food enters the digestive system through the mouth where it's broken down into small pieces as it's chewed before swallowing and then the food passes through the esophagus into the stomach and the small intestine where it's digested and absorbed into the bloodstream. The small intestine has a very large surface area as it's covered by very small finger-like villi which stick out to give the surface area. These are very thin, just about one cell thick to allow nutrients to pass through them into the bloodstream quickly. Excess water is absorbed back into the body in the large intestine. Any undigested food passes out the body through the anus. The liver and pancreas play an important part in the digestive process as the liver produces bile which helps in digesting fats and oils. The pancreas produces biological catalysts called digestive enzymes which are used to speed up the digestive process. Enzymes are not living things, they are special proteins which are able to break down large molecules into small molecules and there are so many different types of enzyme which break down different nutrients. Carbohydrate enzymes break starch down into sugar. Lipase enzymes are used to turn fats and oils into fatty acids and glycerol. Digestion of fat is helped by bile that is made in the liver. Bile breaks fat into small droplets that make it easier for the lipase enzymes to work. The bile itself is not an enzyme. Protease enzymes are used to break down proteins into amino acids. Digestion of proteins is assisted by the acid in the stomach, which also helps to kill microorganisms that may be in the food. Vitamins, minerals and water are already small enough to be absorbed into the body without needing to be broken down in the digestive process. The only thing the body can't digest is dietary fibre, which is passed out of the body. Fibre is important to encourage digestive transit through the body. There are lots of bacteria in the digestive system and about half of the dry weight of faeces consists of bacteria. Bacteria are important as they digest substances that cannot be digested, such as certain carbohydrates. They produce some vitamins such as vitamin K and vitamin B and they reduce the chance of harmful bacteria multiplying which may cause disease.